Welcome to How To Videos from Bugspray.com. Today we're here uh, at one of my relatives' house out here in Phoenix, Arizona. And uh, you can see here a woodpecker has attached, tacked the side of this house, uh, T111 siding. Um, I believe that it was doing this to make an actual nest, uh, but before it had an opportunity to actually finish this hole and make a nest site, we were able to get an attack spider up. And this has been about uh, two weeks now, and there has been no return of the woodpecker with the exception of sounding on the chimney uh, above this area. So, you know, just a little bit of sound from the woodpecker and the attack spider's dropping down right above the hole. And uh, it's been uh, for about two weeks now consistently protecting this area. Even with some pretty torrential rains, I think Monday night they had about four inches of rain. So, uh, the uh, attack spider's doing its job. I'm going to bring the camera up close so you can actually see the damage that the woodpecker was doing to this area. Okay, here we are up close to the hole. And as you can see, the actual hole all goes all the way through the siding. And that's uh, some really thick siding. It's got to be two inches of wood that this uh, woodpecker has torn through in a very short period of time. And again, just above it, always protecting the area. The good old attack spider. Just waiting for the woodpecker to start tapping. Now, anybody that's not familiar with the woodpecker, they are a very flighty bird and they're almost impossible to catch in the act. So, the attack spider is an excellent woodpecker to turn. Okay, over here, that's the end of the house where the attack spider has been installed. If you come right over here, you can see the chimney cap. And if we come in on it, for literally for years, that woodpecker has been coming to this area and landing on top of that and sounding. So it's not such a big deal if it does that, but uh, when it starts attacking the side of your house and tearing holes in it, you really need to do something. Close, here's a close-up view. I patched this hole yesterday. Unfortunately, didn't have the video camera going at the time because when I got up there to patch it, the darn spider it took me off the darn ladder. So that would have been, that would have been some great YouTube video. <laughs> anyway, there you go. Patched and painted. Let's see. Not perfect, but right in there is the patch. Pretty good job. Well, I hope you learned something and thank you for watching this how-to video from bugspray.com.